what's up guys welcome to pro realities tv home of the freshest entertainment news and entertaining video kindly hit the subscribe button if you've not subscribed and if you've already subscribed i appreciate it peace what's up guys welcome back to pro realities tv home of the freshest entertainment news and filler and as you always know i bring you nothing but the hottest filler and the current filler going around today has to do with training jonas yes yes anytime you hear training jonas you know there's a controversy going on and in this in this filler it also has to do with another controversial guy i'm talking about Shatawali, SM Emperor himself, Mr. Pa 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 Pa. Well, we all know Trini Jonas has been like like a voice for the youth. You understand? He's been on our leaders, but for for a couple of months now, telling them to develop the country, talking about the road, how bad the road is, how the economy is, bad water. He's just been giving it to all of our leaders who are incompetent and has been in power for a minute. People who begged us to vote for them and after getting the power, they seem not to know what to do. All they know how to do is borrow, borrow, increase tariff and increase tariff. It looks like they have no plans for the youth of this country. Well, Trini Jonas has been somebody who's been very outspoken on the development and in, in, in Ghana and in Africa at large. We all know like recently Shatawale uh, had an issue with some road contractors who were trying to fix the road and Shata unfortunately was on that lane and was trying to pass and they didn't allow him to pass and it became a back back and forth that at the end of the day even Shata came and apologized. Well Trini Jonas has been very mad in regards to that and has been blasting Shata for through a live video he just did saying that look shatter i've been fighting for these leaders to fix the road so if they are fixing the road and you as a celebrity who you could have even joined me to fight against them but he's wrong on that because shatter is somebody who has been on the government for a very long time you understand shatter also fights for the heat but in this regard training jonas is saying look i've been blasting them for so long so that they can fix the road but shatter instead of now they've even listened to what i'm saying and they are trying to fix the road you're also going there and taking boys there to go cause confusion so he was really unhappy about that and was blasting shatter left and right saying shatter doesn't have sense with jimmy in yama, yama you understand but uh that's between them that's what's going on what chili jonas is saying i understand him in a bit and what shatter also happened i also understand in a bit none of them are right but all of them actually fail for the country so i understand them both and fixing the road is also a way of helping in developing the country so if people are trying to fix the road and you know there's a misunderstanding going on it's not really nice you understand so uh shut out i think he himself felt that he was wrong for that that's why he came and apologized and at the same time i also understand and Trini Jonas, you know, blasting Shatter for what Shatter did. You understand? But let me know what you think in regards to this. Do you think that Trini Jonas had the right to blast Shatter? And even after Shatter coming out to come and, you know, apologize for what he did and begging the contractor that he had that kind of misunderstanding way, is Trini Jonas fair in criticizing and blasting shatter that way for me i don't see any problem in both sides but i understand both sides at the same time let me know what you think in regards to that let me know in the comment section so we can have a conversation in regards to that as you always know kindly hit the subscribe button if you've not subscribed and if you're already subscribed i appreciate it as you always know i'll be back with the next filler peace